Thank you, Kim Potter, for putting out this information. It was a wonderful reminder. Now I will play a video of a woman who is possessed and who is being interviewed. Miss Cross, look at me. You're arrested. <laughs> the serpents. What serpents? Look at what. Kill them. Before repentance. Before repentance. Hmm? <laughs> Why is Jesus coming soon? <laughs> so they're trying to kill as many as they can before he comes. When is he coming? Soon. You don't know. No one knows. But we know it's soon, right? Time is short, right? I am adding an edited 10 minute clip I worked on last year Halloween. It is an hour long, but interesting. Pamaria, a mark of the beast, part one will be linked. With the blood of the aborted fetuses. We mentioned previously that fetuses and were purposely murdered for their cells. These cells were extracted from the living fetuses by these atheist scientists and doctors who don't hold anything sacred and holy. They also remove the organs from a living fetus, organs from a living fetus. If the fetus is dead, the organs and the cells are useless. Therefore, they are not taking the fetuses from the waste bin, which even if they were, does not make it morally right, as an abortion has taken place. However, in this case, these fetuses were specifically prepared for an abortion. So the devil confesses, I am already inside those who took it via the blood of the fetuses, and how he felt Satan hugging him, and though he was trying to read salutations, his blood was burning in his veins, and he felt someone saying to him, You belong to me now.